This story is for those who are not satisfied with their own life and consider others always happier than them. To understand this story, watch the video until the end. Once upon a time, there was a very unhappy crow. One day, in tears, it started to cry while sitting on a branch of a tree. A monk was sitting leaning against the tree and at that moment a drop of the crow's tears fell on the cheek of the monk. The monk raised his head and saw the crow crying. The monk asked him, My friend, what is the problem? Why are you crying? The crow replied, Wise one, I am very upset about my life. No one loves me, people chase me away with disdain, no one feeds me, and everyone hates me. Death is better than such a life. Hearing the words of the crow, the monk's heart was filled with compassion and he said, my friend, we should learn to be happy whatever our condition. But the crow did not understand the wisdom of the monk and continued to cry. Then the monk said, do not be sad. Tell me what do you want to become? The happy crow said, if you want to do me a favor, make me a swan. The monk replied, all right, I will transform you into a swan, but first go to the swan and ask him if he is happy with his life or not. In the meantime, I will wait for you here." The crow flew happily to meet the swan. He saw a swan swimming in a pond and approached him, saying, How beautiful you are! You are white as milk, everyone loves you, you must be the happiest bird in the world. The swan replied to the crow with a sad heart, No, my friend, I am not happy. There are so many beautiful colors in the world, but I have no color. White is an insignificant color. I think the parrot is the happiest bird in the world. It's so colorful. Hearing this, the crow flew away from there and reached the parrot. He said to it, you are so colorful and beautiful, you must be the happiest bird in the world. The parrot replied to the crow with a sad heart, no, my friend, I am not happy. See, people keep parrots in a cage. I am always afraid that someone will catch me and lock me in a cage. I think the peacock is the happiest bird in the world. It is much more colorful than me. Hearing this, the crow flew in search of a peacock. After a long search, he finally found a peacock that was locked in a cage in a zoo. He saw that hundreds of people had gathered to see it. After the people left, the crow approached the peacock and said, Dear peacock, you are so beautiful. Every day thousands of people come to see you. Look at me, instead, when people see me, they immediately chase me away. I think you are the happiest bird on the planet. The peacock replied sadly, I have always thought that I was the most beautiful and happy bird on the planet, but because of my beauty, I am imprisoned in this zoo. When people pluck my colorful feathers to make decorative objects, it hurts me a lot. The peacock sighed deeply and said, I am not happy. The crow was surprised to hear this from the peacock and asked him, If you are not happy, who is the happiest bird in the world? The peacock replied, I have carefully examined the zoo and realized that you, crow, are the only bird not kept in a cage. People do not try to catch you and imprison you. So, in the last days, I thought that if I were a crow, I could fly happily anywhere and be free. Hearing this, the crow flew away from there and today for the first time felt happy to be a crow. He returned to that branch and said to the wise monk, I don't want to be anything else, I'm fine as I am. So the monk replied, if we always observe other lives, we discover that we make useless comparisons with others and then become sad and curse ourselves. We do not recognize what we have and all this leads to a vicious circle of unhappiness. We should learn to be happy with what we have rather than looking at what we do not have. There will always be someone who will have more or less than us. If we continue to compare ourselves with others, we will never be able to be happy. A person who is satisfied with what they have is the happiest in the world. If you like this video, subscribe to the Limitless Horizons channel and activate the bell. Thank you for watching, leave your comment, and see you in the next one.